Hello everybody, it's Christmas Vogue Mental Vending Rumpa 2, Goodbye Despair. <laughs> Good job. I'm gonna avoid Discord for a bit. Uh, Good in the job. last episode, what the fuck did we do? Hmm. We started no. investigating no. the no. hospital. We didn't, we started investigating the, you know what? You read the line, I'm gonna look at the episode. <laughs> Originally, surveillance cameras and surveillance monitors only use one part of, or only use as part of the same unit. I can't even read the line correctly. Nope. <laughs> No, we investigated the fucking uh, hotel and the mall. The mall. The mall. <laughs> the, the motel and the movie theater. We didn't investigate the hospital. The video that was filmed within the hospital, with not within, with the hospital camera, could only be viewed on the hospital monitor. The video that was filmed with the music venue camera can only be used, can only be seen on the music venue monitor. I can't English. Yeah, it's even though it's really. But if I left, obvious. like we already read, the, I think we did this conversation already. We just yeah, we swapped the cameras. Yeah, we did this part. We gotta go in there. That's clean. Oh hi, Akane. I thought you were the crime scene. Now then. Phew! Finally getting back to my normal self. Right. Hajime, help me out with my recovery. If you can touch my boobs, if you win. What? No thanks. What? She was bearable when she was quiet. It'd be so much better if she was still feeling the after. <laughs> Fuck you, Hajime! You'd rather you have her. Such a you'd rather have her say she wouldn't cry if you touched you'd her. You'd rather have her be in pain and despair than having her say you can touch her boobs. Like okay, no, 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 no. even if, if no, you no, decline no. the offer. Even if you decline the offer, why the fuck would you rather have her in despair mode? Well, no, 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 no. What he's saying is he'd rather have her offer something else to get the boob touching than fighting her. No! <laughs> anyway, why are you here? Hey, hey! Well, I've never been sick or hurt before, so I had no idea, but... <laughs> Hospital gowns are pretty comfy. I was thinking I might, might as well keep wearing Do one. Doesn't that mean that she'd be, like, not covered in the backside? Yeah, you in general, Joe, you're completely stark naked when you're wearing a hospital gown. Completely. Knowing her, knowing her, she'd wear it over her clothes. Yeah, she would wear it over her clothes, like a smart. Oh well, no, she would think it was a bathing suit, so she would just put it on over her already not bathing suit. Don't tell me you plan to wear hospital gowns from now on. Mm. That's the idea, but it looks like they're out of stock. It looks like there was one gown from each patient's room, so I thought there'd be more in the empty rooms. There weren't any gowns? Yeah. Yep, that's right. Ibuki died wearing one, so the only one left is the one Nagito was wearing. Then what was no, yours? No, I don't think you should wear that one. <laughs> I, if I have no choice, then I should use Nagito's. If it's a unisex size, I'll probably be able to fit it. I wouldn't wear that. Yeah, what happened to the gown you were wearing? That's what I was thinking. Like, she burned it in a fiery pit of hell. Are you saying I should wear the one I already wore? That's gross. But wearing the one Nagito had is not gross. Yeah, no, don't worry. Wearing someone else's clothes is even... Less gross than wearing your own dirty clothes. Yep. No time to dilly-dally. I totally left Mekon back in the music venue. Crap, I gotta go back soon. <laughs> Since I've already investigated the music venue, but I'm leaving her on guard duty was a bad idea. I'm a cheap man. Well, we need to figure out... Yes. What? No, go this some is Ibuki's... Go somewhere else. That's fucking Ibuki's room. Really? Am I supposed to go upstairs? I don't know. Maybe. Oh, you actually just run up the stairs in this one instead of just... Oh, is this where the... The... The, the off-call... On-call room? Yeah, where's the on-call room? Is that just the staff room? That's the ER. Or the CAT scan room. Yeah, that's the CAT scan room. That's the alien probe room. What? Wait, wait, what? <laughs> You saw that too, no, right? Don't worry about it. It's a legitimate thing. You saw that too, right? It's just it's just floating. It's a cat scan that's just floating. It's the conference room. So that's the on-call room, right? No, that's the conference room. Where the fuck is the on-call room? What's this? It's pitch black. I can't see anything. Where's the switch? Hey, don't turn it on. Chiaki. What are you doing in here? What are you doing in here? Huh? Ichiaki, are you there? Guys, if you turn the light on, it's gonna be fully exposed. It'd be embarrassing. Shut up. Shut up. Shut up. W what's fully exposed? Hey. Hey, Hajime. If you poke out your eyes, you can turn the lights. You can turn on the light. What are you gonna do? 
Are you gonna poke him out? I'm not gonna poke out my eyes. Aww. <laughs> Bummer. The, what the f- Troll fail. What the fuck? No sooner did she finish saying that, I heard the dry sound of curtains being drawn. There was a flash of intense light that stung my eyes a little. I squinted my eyes until they started adjusting to the light. And there it is. I saw Chiaki had finished opening the curtain that was covering the window. Chiaki, you're really bad at trolling. <laughs> just just thought I'd say that. The ultimate right. gamer is terrible at trolling. Yeah, it's kind of funny. I don't think she really I don't think she's really done it before. Nope. I'm guessing. Were you not surprised? As well. Surprised? I don't get it. Well, I got it. Got what? See? The curtains in this conference room are designed to completely block out light. There's a projector in here, so they were probably careful about shining light through. See? See? A black curtain that blocks light and is also long enough to reach the floor. It's perfect. Wait a minute. A black block light blocking curtain. I... Hey, wait a minute. There's <laughs> another one that's missing. I'm still in the middle of investigating, so that's a secret. Yep, she's upset. But still, what was that all about? That bit about being embarrassing if I look and troll fail? Nope. I just wanted to mess with you. Yep, she's definitely upset. Why is she- <laughs> Wow! Why is she acting so childish? I don't know, maybe because she's a gamer. Th that was all you had to investigate in the hospital! Are you fucking kidding me? Don't you see that there's clearly- Also, wow, what? Are we just at the trial? <laughs> that are, we are we just at the trial now? Eight minute video. Bye, guys! Oh, how's everybody doing? It's me, Monokuma! Yay! Awesome! The I, class I guess trial's we're the gonna trial. start, you yes. know? I... So, make sure you guys come to Monokuma Rock ASAP! Uh, I, I guess we're at the trial? I guess we're at the trial? <laughs> you thought we had a lot more I'll left, didn't you? you? So. I thought we had at least enough to fill out a video. Nope. <laughs> I could technically end it now. <laughs> no, we're less than 10 minutes in. I could, I could technically do that. Well, it's already time. So this again. I need to go to that place. That one place. That one place we'll never know. But now's not the Monokuma. time. But now's not the time to be dead or a coward. The reason Ibuki and Hyoko became victims in order to find the truth. The only thing I could do is go. Go into the depths of despair. Yep. In Monokuma's belly. Yep. <laughs> you could say they're going to the belly of the beast. <laughs> you could say you could fuck off. You can't go anywhere except Monokuma. Oh yeah, it's in Gibraltar. It's in Watchpoint, Gibraltar. Gibraltar Park. Is it on the second island? It, it's 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 on it's it's here. Is it? Oh, it's it right is right there. What Mount Monokuma Rushmore? Mount Mount Rushmore Kuma. Monokuma Rock. Mount Rock Rushmore. <laughs> <laughs> Mount uh, Mount what? I I don't even rock know. Rock Mushmore? I don't even. <laughs> <laughs> I don't even know what I said. <laughs> Everyone who heard the announcement had gathered in front of Monokuma Rock. And soon enough... Welcome. Is everybody here? Do you guys want to go to the class trial? No. Hey, jerk! Hold it right there, you jerk! We can't. Me, such a dumb child. They were, they were still missing, um... What? Don't get in my way! Maru. You're just a little dumb sister who's a shred of you brain cells. My brain works just fine, you dark. Hey, hey. Monokuma, what did you do with Nekamuru? Hmm. I see. So you've come to avenge him. Yes. Avenge? That sounds like he died. <laughs> sounds like you say. Oops. Anyway. Anyway, since Nekamuru is unfortunately unavailable today, let's just say he's absent. Uh, bye. Now then, I gotta go first. I will let you escape! She's getting up tied up again. Hey, did you did you hear what he said? Huh? Just don't worry about it. There's no way Nekomaru is dead. He's just trying to piss us off. D damn it! Of course he's not dead. There's no way, not in a million years. He would Whoa. die in a million years though. He doesn't have an infinite lifespan. Read your Read your line, Nagito! More importantly, it's best if we worry about ourselves for now. God damn it, this fucking voice. <laughs> If something happens here, 
every one of us except Nekumaru will die. No, wouldn't Nekumaru die anyway? No, if Nekumaru is the killer, then everyone... How would he be the killer? Exactly. The He's saying if Nekomaru is the killer, then everyone He's except Nekomaru would- saying if something would... happens here, everyone- if they pick the wrong person, everyone but Nekomaru die? Well, that- And the killer? No. No, but in that case, everyone except Nekomaru would die only if Nekomaru is the killer. Which makes no goddamn sense. Which makes no sense. Considering he was in the hospital before the killings happened! <laughs> Why are you so excited about that? How about it? Who knows? Maybe I'm just looking forward to seeing Poetic Justice prevail. Maybe. Is that the new serial killer, Poetic Justice? <sighs> what are you saying, fiend? <laughs> You'll find out soon enough. Take this LSD fiend? packet. Okay, let's go. I'm gonna do it! Alright, let's hurry up and let's get this over with! Yeah, you're right. Lol, nope. Let's talk with everyone. <laughs> I haven't been helpful at all. I couldn't even figure out an estimated time of death. I'm sorry, I'm such a useless piece of trash. Yeah, you pig shit. According yeah, you, to Dead Heel. Yeah, you nasty trashy pig shit. No! Even the dead are insulting her. Hi. <laughs> yes, Sonia. I'm sure they are. Yoko, it must be my fault, after all. Well? Then I must learn the truth behind this murder most foul. Now, let us proceed. Nope. Are you just delaying so you can end the video? <laughs> hey, let's go. There's no time to waste. I it, there's all the time to waste right now. I know it's sad, but we need to move forward, and then we need to end this once and for all. Jeez. I already figured this, but it's best if we don't rely on Monami all that much. She's just saying stupid mean things just to make us even more confused. <laughs> you added a word there. Uh, maybe it's just to shut her up for good. You're still changing. This will shut her up for good. Fine. What the fuck? Oh, it's another camera. Hmm. It's about time I show up with my serious side. Let's make history. Jeez, how, tr how about a troublesome? But I suppose I can display my true power for the sake of our two fallen comrades. Hi, Soda. This is bad. Hey, what did Monokuma mean just now? Don't tell me Nakamura's already... Don't get distracted by Monokuma. We need to focus on the class trial right now. Uh, I know, but... You just gotta focus on it right now. Talk to Akane. Hmm. Just as I thought, this particular incident... <laughs> Oops, we can continue this later, right, Hajime? What's wrong with him? He's even creepier than usual. He's on he's on the LSD. He's on he's on the D. I'm gonna do it! What are you whining about? Hurry up and get this over with already! Then we can greet Coach Nekamaru with open arms when he comes back. Uh sure thing. She just clicked the damn thing already. No! <laughs> I didn't know it was Wait. like human. Oh, uh, do, do let me. Uh, fucking, what was the voice? What was the song? It was like, I am roasting on the wings of fire. Bleh. Just tipped onto the escalator and ascended towards the gaping maw of Monokuma Rock, and then I noticed it. I noticed our, line, our lined up silhouettes kept getting smaller and smaller, but I can't turn back now. If I turn back, I won't be able to press forward. That is the literal definition. That is the literal definition of, you know, not looking back now. Wow, there's so few of them left. I mean, yeah, there's two, four, there's ten six, of them left. Eight, there's only nine of them left. Ten. Well, plus Nekumara. I meant in the elevator, there's nine of them. Well, yeah. But nobody said a word. As we stood there trying to figure out what to say to each other, the end of the elevator to send it deeper and deeper. The end of the elevator. The end of the elevator. Also, you're changing. It's slowly the turning. Hajime does not sound like no, that. No, don't worry. This is his new voice now. And descended, and it descended as far as it could go. It finally stopped. The elevator doors opened slowly, almost tantalizingly so. Yes, uh, light poured through the other side and rolling in boundaries of darkness. And I walked into that place. With a different light. Oh God! 
It's huh. green. It's not this. It's not green. It's parts of it that are green, but that's not what I was getting at. It's more like a fucking uh, under underground dungeon. <laughs> My, my! It feels pretty toothless with all these empty seats. <laughs> well, two people got killed at the same time, and Nekomaru's not here either. Hey. Is Nekomaru really not participating? If he's alive, you should invite him. No, if he's no. in critical condition, you can't really invite him down here. Why bother? Well, then, it, well, why he'll the get, fuck? He'll get pneumonia. Yeah. <laughs> and he'll get pneumonia and die. <laughs> um... But then why why the hell would Fuyuhiko still be here? Because he's still... But he's still critical. What? Now then, let's begin. The beginning of the long-awaited class trial. Please enjoy to your heart's content. Maybe Nekumaru's like a coma. He can't really... And so the curtain to the third class trial is about to open. Yoda. <laughs> Great job. <laughs> I just saw my brain just kind of died for a second. And I was like, Miyota. <laughs> Miyota. We'll and never get to hear that hit song of I just plopped out a baby. I don't know who the father is. No, it's I squeezed out the baby and I don't know who the father is. Same thing. Nope. Plopping no. and squeezing are the same thing. Yeah. Remember In plopping and squeezing? Babies. Yeah, you just like. <laughs> That's how you plop out a baby. Or you squeeze it out like... <laughs> <laughs> the was... noises are super accurate. Oh, very accurate. At least you didn't say, like, you squeeze it out. <laughs> how the fuck? <laughs> how wet is this baby, Joe? Also, when can you slide something and it goes... <laughs> we have already been over this. Stop. She was really loud, but she was a mood maker of our group. When I was with her, all of my pain and suffering seemed to melt away until I realized that my character somehow was very annoyed by Ibuki at every time she said anything. <laughs> and then there's Yoko Sayonji, the ultimate the traditional ultimate janitor. Bitch. <laughs> Sir. <laughs> Fuck you. From Just from looking at the... She's not the ultimate bitch, she's just little bitch. <laughs> There are way more bitchy characters and who will games. who will be the world's best exterminator now? What? Oh <laughs> fuck! <laughs> Shut up. Her squish squishy skills actually saved millions of bugs. Just from Not looking at her adorable <laughs> face, you'd never know she was actually selfish and foul mouthed. I mean, you're right. But once you figure out that she's selfish and foul mouthed, she quickly lowers tears in the in Best Girl trilogy. Trilogy. She didn't save bugs by squish squishing them. As she was trying, but she was dead. This is this is the reason that she was kind of redeemed, which only made it more obvious that she was gonna die. Yep. But she was trying to change herself, and she was desperately trying to come to terms with my hero's death. The person who killed those two is among us. <laughs> you could say it's the killer within. And I'm still dead. That's not his it. voice. And now, and now I am, and so am I. <laughs> whether, wow, so but whether I believe I. it or not is what? Oh, Peko. oh but we and haven't seen Peko and yet. So am I. Hey, shut up, you trashy pig shit! I'm not Mekon. I'm a tool. <laughs> Holy fuck! <laughs> well, it's, stay tuned for Dang and Rampa a bridge done by us. <laughs> Except no. <laughs> you trashy bitch! I am not Mikan. I am a tool. I am. I am a tool. Great comedy. Unless I figure <laughs> out the truth, I won't be able to escape from this hell. That's why I must find out, no matter the cost, for our sake. What if the cost is your life? For our friends' sake. For Ibuki's and Hyoko's sake. For Monokuma's sake! And so... I might as well get bored. Life-threatening fucking! <laughs> <laughs> you know, everyone's favorite of fucking life-threatening fucking. Life-threatening fucking. I, don't, I honestly want to at least start the trial and get through a few investi uh, investigative parts. Uh, let's Wait, go. you can't pause and save in the middle of the trial, can you? Yeah, I can. Oh, yeah, you Fuck can. yeah, I can. What do you, you think should, I was able to do in the last game? You should equip skills, because you never do that. I should do that, actually. You know what? I'm going to equip You should skill. buy skills. Because you, you only have one skill. You never bought any other skills. Hey, uh... Hey, uh... 
Hey, uh, uh, Monami. Monami, can you uh, help a brother out? Um, you got 24, buy some shit. I need the, the ones for, like, time. Those are really the ones I want. I don't want anything to really, like, be cheap. Oh, you want the one for- you want the one for the- for the one with the swords. Hang on. The slashy. Hang on. The, the slashy? <laughs> yeah. Hang on. The cut through Hang the words on. or whatever? Hang on. Increase damage to the opponent when a statement is destroyed. Panic talk action. Uh, no. I don't need that. Bullet capacity. I I think I'm I think I'm gonna need that for this one, but I don't think so. Allows you to lock on at two statements at once. Interesting. Easier to shift the mood to your favor. Do that one. I want this. Yes. Yes, you want that. That was like the bane of our existence last yeah, trial. Yeah. Holy fuck. Sharpness Sharp. increases by two. Yes. Oh wait, let's find sword. Whoa, get that one. Increase by two or increase by five. One is six and one is four. Five, get the five. Yeah. You have 18, get the five. Okay. Uh, clock up. Increase max speed. Increase, increase Maneuver. Power. Increase, increase turning, turning power. power. Increase, increase jumping jump. power. Slightly increases your influence gauge. If that's during class trial, cannot that's the be used health, with right? envious influence. What's envious influence? Uh, I don't know. Slightly increases the focus gauge. That's, uh, freezing. Uh, time limit. That's what I need. I need they the equip time that limit shit. increase. Equip all those. I think we're good. Uh, What's trigger happy do? Trigger happy just make it just uh, makes you fire bullets faster, which I'll also need because I somehow seem to miss bullets a lot. All right, now all right. equip all that shit. It's like I forget that the hope fragments are actually useful. Oh fuck! You have 38. You're fine. Can I equip all of them? I think that's all of them. Yeah, and you only use 25. Yeah! See, you just made the trial way easier for yourself, probably. Good. Let's go! Class you throw should, you begin! Should, you should save now that you bought that. Now you should probably then, save. Let's begin with this. I don't know what you're talking about. That's the wrong button. Now that you bought all of the shit. Shh. It's fine. Even though, technically, I was gonna, uh... Ugh, fuck, I should've saved that in pre-trial, perhaps, so it'd be cleaner. Whatever, fuck it. Fuck it. Fuck it. It's cleaner. During the class trial, you will present your art if you vote Yee. correctly. I know the how this works. Punish everyone. Oh well, who cares about this boring explanation? Let's get on with it already. Yes. I don't mind starting the trial, but I don't really have a grasp of how the case played out. Because you were up dead. You know. Up dead. Because I was asleep the whole time. That's what I meant. <laughs> Even if you do grasp it, you're just gonna confuse the heck out of us, aren't you? But sure. But Ito's not alone. I don't really get it either. And the dead person. You're fine. Your head's empty anyway. <laughs> Damn, Soda being <laughs> savage. <laughs> What's wrong with that? Look at that. The emptier your head, the more dreams you can stuff inside it. You know? Hey. Hey. That's she's, a true. She's not wrong. That's a true quote from the. <laughs> I was about to say the emoji movie. <laughs> Look at meant to say the Lego movie. Look at her face. Not the same. She picked the best emoticon expression. <laughs> the emojicon? I said emoticon expression, but it's sure. not just an emoji. It's just an expression. <laughs> I you know. You idiot. <laughs> anyway, we shouldn't proceed with the trial if those two can't participate in the arguments. Since he's the first witness. Why don't we ask Hajime to explain the incident and the sequence of events? Fuck, you're not wrong. Then, let's start with when we split into the hospital team and motel team because of the despair disease. The team motel. Well, we get to go over the, the case, too. The hospital team consisted of Nagito, Ibuki, and Akane, who were infected, and Mikan, Fuyuhiko, and me. Mm-hmm. The other five in the motel team were myself, Gundam, Kazuichi, Chiaki, and Hyoko. Uh, and Neko Maru? No, he's in the hospital. So because he was in intensive care with Monica. Wait a sec, but no, he was still with them. No, he wasn't! He was... Before disparity was oh, implemented, oh, right, he right. took this half the rocket right, launcher. Right, right, that happened like literally before the, the spare disease mm -hmm. hit, okay. Because the next morning, the spare disease hit. Right, right, right. I woke up at my cottage on the day the incident happened. Nikon came by to wake me up and told me that none wake. of had recovered from his symptoms. We immediately headed over to the hospital, and after we confirmed his recovery, I made Mikan rest in the on-call room, since she hadn't slept all night, while I waited in the hospital lobby. And then, I saw the incoming signal light on the surveillance camera blinking before our scheduled time. 
when I pressed the button to turn on the monitor, what appeared on screen was... The death. A video of someone wearing a hospital gown and a hip bag on their head, climbing a stepladder. Amazing! That's such a hard-pounding story! And then what did you do, Hajime? Fuck you! I, I tried to stop them, of course. I rushed out of the hospital and ran to where the video was being recorded, the music venue. Come on, Johnny. But it was too late. By the time I arrived, the person wearing the hemp bag on their head was already hanging from the ceiling. I thought I should tell the others right away, so I headed to the motel. Why the motel? Because it was close to the music venue. And unlike the hospital, there were more able-bodied people there. At least, that's what I thought. But the only person who came with me was Chiaki. Gundam refused to go with you. But I remember feeling a little relieved because not long after, we met up with Mikan and Fuyuhiko. We were also looking for Ibuki since she disappeared from our sight. After I rested for a bit, I started counting the food at the hospital. Mm-hmm. And then I noticed Ibuki was gone. So I, I sprinted out of the hospital. And somehow didn't trip. Accidentally, I ran into Fuyuhiko. So I fled with him in various ways <gasps> to see if he could help me out. Various ways? You find these various ways that you oh, helped him out. Oh, please do. I am all ears. She tripped and showed him her salad. <laughs> she showed him her salad? <laughs> that just sounds like a vag joke and waiting various to be made. Ways? <laughs> yeah, so does like. And confuse people. <laughs> Someone's blushy. After I heard from those two that Ibuki disappeared, I had a feeling she was the person wearing the hemp bag. I mean, it's obvious immediately because her hair is long. So I immediately led them to the music venue. But the door wouldn't open. Since we had no other option, the four of us broke down the door. And when that happened, we didn't just find Ibuki's body. We also found Hiyoko's. There's also the fucking drumstick. That. Her body was taped to a pillar. That's when we heard the body discovery announcement. Not once, but twice in a row. Mm-hmm. They both died. And so, we decided to lower the hanged body, didn't we? When we removed the hemp bag, just as we feared, it was Ibuki. So that's how the case played out. Thank you. I understood it very easily. Well, it's clear- Due to my drug addiction. Cases, when Hajime left the music venue, who- Wait, how do I know anything Hajime just said is true? We have evidence. Wait. Yes, we have evidence. Sorry, I'm only being impartial right now. And the story I just heard is clearly suspicious. I mean, it is. It he really, doesn't have an alibi. He doesn't have an alibi. <laughs> um, but the videotape, uh, the the video, the, the the imitation murder Monokuma theater thing. That doesn't. That's not coming into play yet. We need to basically give an alibi for ourselves right now. Hajime. If you're the only one who saw the hanging yep. video, yep. and the first one to describe it, I, I had a feeling he would bring this up. Then you could be lying as much as you want right now, right? Why? Why would I lie? Obviously. So you could make us ignore what might be an inconvenient truth for you. His logic doesn't. Do you doubt? His logic correct. If you're not lying, I would like you to prove it. Come on, try to prove it to me. Prove you're not the killer. Bruh! Yep, it's just as Kazuichi said. Nagito's the kind of guy who will just confuse us and make matters worse. Damn it, I should have explained it to Nagito. I'm in trouble now thanks to that. Well, okay, time to time to affirm somebody else's statement or prove him wrong. Uh, well, I'm, I'm sure. Let's see, what do we... Surveillance? Yeah, the, the fucking video. How? Hajime's testimony is clearly suspicious. Oh yeah, it's a take. It's not. And the fact that Ibuki hung herself. That would also be a lie. I don't think I can deny that possibility. After all, Hajime is the only witness. That's not. Oh wait. Oh, Hajime is the only witness. Wait a second. Damn it. Hajime is the only witness. Hajime's no, that's not it. He's clearly suspicious. Hajime's testimony is a lie. Affirm it, the no. testament's a lie. 
it's not. That would also be a lie. I don't think I can deny that possibility. I have no idea what it is. After all, Hajime is the only witness. Why would Hajime lie? Well, obviously because he's the killer. I think you're right. Did Hajime kill both of them? The fact that the bodies were imitating the movie. That's no. It's imitating the movie. You can contradict that. Wait a second. Contra I know. Contradict with that your, with, with what? your ticket, right? Hajime's your ticket has a date and time suspicious. on it. Yeah. No. Wait a fuck. Wait a fucking minute. He was there. He, he was took there. You to, he took you to see the goddamn movie what too. What the fuck? No, that's wrong. Yeah, I was about to say like, didn't you say? Not you, but like he told, you. He told you to keep the ticket specifically. Too. I mean, there's no way I'd be able to imitate that movie. He never saw it. Of course you're not. I already knew that. Then why did you bring it up? Huh? Before the incident, Hajime had never watched that movie. His invitation ticket is proof of that. Each person only received one ticket, and they're marked with a stamp that shows the date and time. Isn't that right, Monokuma? Oh, he's gonna bring it up so that everyone shows their yes. tickets. No mistakes there! Which means there's no way Hajime, who never saw the movie, could commit murders that imitated it. Or did anyone tell him what happened to nope. the movie? Of course no one did, right? Yeah, because he he's paid a hundred million dollars for a button. You're the one who brought this up in the first place. Nagito, what are you doing? Well, since we're opening with your witness testimony, I thought we should solidify the foundation. It also provides a good warm-up. Fuck you, Nagito. What warm-up? This isn't a game, you know. Yeah, <laughs> no, no, don't worry. This is this is real life. Don't get mad. I just think warming up is really important. What a waste of time. Whoops. Well, I knew it would turn out like this anyway. Of course you did. Now then, since we know Hajime's testimony is reliable, let us move on to the arguments. So this means Ibuki definitely climbed the stepladder all by herself, right? Yeah, I'm positive. Then that seals it! Ibuki committed suicide! No, I don't think it I does. I don't think so. If Ibuki committed suicide, then who killed Hiyoko? Hmm, a murder coincidentally occurring in the same place as a suicide ain't possible, huh? No, like not I at said all. Before, it's pretty clear what the problem with this case is. The killer murdered Hiyoko while Hajime was gone. Yes. That's all we gotta do make any sense, is establish sure. who could have possibly done that. No, like wait, ten, no, 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 wait. Ten minutes. Right, to... no, I said that Hiyoko died before Ibuki died. Yeah, that's yeah, how that's I. Like, that's how I believe it's to you, be you're happening. You're contradicting your prior guessing. Yeah, assumptions, not guesses. Uh, yeah, this is this is it's good. This is good that I don't review the evidence so that I fucking <laughs> contradict your old statements. No, it make it makes it funner. It makes you it more interesting. How long would you say you were away from the music venue? I couldn't have been gone for more than ten minutes. So they killed Hiyoko and taped her up within ten minutes? There's no way that's possible. No, right? no. Well, they taped her up after she already died. That's why the killer stalled for time by making the music venue a closed room. Hmm? What do you mean, a closed room? The storage closet. The killer blocked the venue door from the oh, inside right, the, to try and keep the, us from entering the right away. I don't know Drumstick, not a guitar pick. <laughs> <laughs> guitar pick you know would what? not have closed you know the door what? It would be a really huge guitar pick. <laughs> However, that like door the size of Ibuki's head. The music venue, right? Probably bigger. Ibuki's head's not that big. That could be taken in multiple ways. Um, if they blocked the door from the inside, the killer would not have been able to leave either. Yeah, you're absolutely right. Which means, when we broke down the venue door, the killer was still inside. <laughs> they were? If that's the case, the only suspicious people are those who don't have an alibi for that time. Which is every everyone everyone who wasn't there. So that would include Sonia, uh Sonia Gundam so Gundam. Um Oh no, Gundam was it couldn't have been Gundam. No, because he was Sonya. at the hotel. <laughs> Sonya and Kazuichi, that's the other one I was Kazuichi. thinking of. Me too? What the hell? Why's it gonna be us? The others all have alibis. Chiaki, Mikan, Hajime, and I all broke down the venue door together. 
Gundam met up with Hajime at the motel right before that. And if Akane and Nagito were laid up in the hospital, the only person that leaves is one of you. There's another person who doesn't have an alibi. You know, Nekomaru. Me too! Huh? What? You're kidding, right? You're not up to something weird, are you? <laughs> Please stop making bad jokes. Anyway, if the killer was hiding inside the venue, we should obviously doubt the people who don't have alibis. What a wicked way of backing us into a wall. Is this his professional skill? See, okay. With I mean, soda, it makes logical sense. With soda, he left immediately because it was too hot. But the killer was inside the music venue. Fuhiko obviously thinks so, but is it really that? I don't know. Let's, let's see what the well, argument choices are. Well, okay. Well, no, no, no. Hold on. I think that the temperature itself could be a Here we um. Go. The killer was still inside the music venue. glob. My oh, that, that, dis the inside. that disproves it, doesn't it? They tried to keep us from getting in. It seems they were trying to stall for time. They were. It's not contradictive. How did they lock the door? That door should not have had a lock. It doesn't. The lock was on the floor in front of the door. What? Are you talking about the broken drumstick? Nope. You can use that as a bolt to lock the door. By doing that, the killer who was hiding inside waited until we gathered together. And suddenly appear. So they look like they had just rushed over. I have seen this in serial crime dramas. That's not something you say when you're a suspect. Hang on. Who's the killer was still in by locking the door? They tried to keep it. Locking it from the inside, I think, is what you have to do. The but they did lock it from the inside. No. How else do you think it got what if, there? What if they broke the drumstick the and put it there as a decoy? Lock. Wait, and just use let me lock was on the floor. Let me try to contradict this. Are you talking about the broken drum? That's a that's a that's not a discredit statement. No, here by doing that, the killer who was waited until we gather and suddenly it wait, so there's nothing there. All oh, right, that's why I think it's the 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 drumsticks not actually the lock, maybe just the goo. The killer was still oh, wait a fucking room. minute. I'm an idiot. I'm a fucking idiot. I'm a fucking idiot. I'm an idiot. I know what to do. I need to take the statement. Shit! Uh, you fucked up. I need to take that statement. Maybe. I don't know if that's actually- That's exactly what we're- We were just talking about the broken drumstick! That's contradictive from Indians uh, for stall for time. No, it's not. Here. Are you talking about the broken drumstick? You didn't collect it. You can use that as What the fuck? How 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 long do you have to hold down that? A lot of time. It's so long. I don't think they locked from the inside. Technically, remember the goop from the door. It, okay, let's present the goop then. As not outside. What? Logic. Planting evidence. To make you go one way. Then why the fuck was it locked? Or not there locked. was goop. Yeah, but then why was the drumstick there? To be deceptive. How would they have gotten the drumstick? They go into the storage room, grab drumstick, break it, put it by the door. Goop, leave. Then how did they tape up Hyoko's body after... I don't know Hajime that Hajime left. It's, it's not saying it definitely wasn't locked from the inside. It's saying there's a possibility it was locked from the outside. From the outside? That's just how my mind yeah. processed goop and outside. There was a semi transparent glass stuck to the venue door. Maybe that's what they used. Semi transparent glob. Like rubber, maybe? It wasn't rubber at all, it was probably GLUE! That semi-transparent glob must have been glue. Glue? Yeah, I think so too. 
It had a firm gel-like chewiness. Oh, yep. And I could smell workshop chemicals the moment I put it in my mouth. Yeah, yeah. Why did you do that? She ate glue as a kid. I'm certain it was glue. I didn't know glue was edible. It's not. I believe it is not something one typically eats. That glue was only applied to the areas where both doors touched by pouring it in the gaps of the closed door. We must have sealed the venue door That's from the That's some pretty outside. strong fucking glue. It is. It took two <laughs> bashes. To that, a glob of glue was left where the door was stuck. Yep. It fits perfectly. It's, uh, I but doubt that. If you just stick them together with glue, you'd be able to break down the door easily, you know? That doesn't really matter. The killer only did that to make us think the door was locked from the inside. What'd you say? First of all, didn't that drumstick we found seem really obvious? Almost unnaturally so? I just put this together recently, like it as we so were debating obvious. it, so. But it makes more sense to think the killer placed it as a diversion. Are you saying the drumstick was a trap the killer set on purpose? Then I... I totally fell for that fucking trap. I'm sorry, Chihiro's not here right now. And me! However, you're not allowed to slice open your stomach this time. In a quarrel, both sides are to blame. That's why it's better to just have no sides at all. So, during the 10 minutes Hajime left the venue, the killer murdered Hiyoko and created a closed space? That seems a bit of a and time And they also taped her up after killing her, right? Constretched. Even Good. quick work has limits. Aww, what unimaginable speed for a slow poke like me. What? If they couldn't have done it while Hajime what? was away from Wait, the hand. What? 10 minutes? Wait. What an unimaginable speed for- Wait, what? During 10 minutes? What does she mean? What? What, what the fuck does that mean? I guess she's saying she couldn't do it because she's slow? That seems like a weird thing to say in the middle of a trial. But I guess it proves she, she couldn't, couldn't have it done it? Like proves? No. It's a statement. <laughs> But when I don't understand why she said it, but whatever. <laughs> Ibuki's body was there, right? And when you went back with everyone else, Kyoko's body was there too, right? But it's possible that the body was just revealed at that time, when Kyoko was actually killed earlier. Just revealed? Of course, the body wasn't revealed on its own. The killer did that too. Here, I have proof. There you go. That thing. That scrap of paper. Is that what we found in the baton lighting at the music venue? You had your hamster go up and retrieve it. But How nah. are you to tell me that you do not know what that is? No, no, he's confirming that it's the same piece of paper. Oh. That's right, but... <laughs> he's not saying, is, is that a piece of paper? paper? <laughs> Shut up. <laughs> is that paper? Yep. I should be able to... Oh no, are we doing logic dive? We're doing a logic dive. No, Hangman's, Hangman's Gambit. Gambit. It's the posters, right? It's the the wallpaper or whatever. I think. Fuck you. <laughs> the poster doesn't have that many letters. It's the only reason I said wallpaper. Oh, uh, give me give me no letters. Oh, oh I love all these whoa, letters. Whoa, 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 me. whoa, 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 whoa. It's just www. Posters.com. Oh, give me all these letters. Oh. Oh. They're gonna get unlucky. There's gonna be the one that comes right next to yeah, that. Yeah, I e. know. Like right on the E. Holy shit. Mm. No. I don't need that anymore. Oh! Jesus! <laughs> oh. You fucked it up! <laughs> the E's gone. You fucked it up so badly! <laughs> Whoops. Did it just make a gulping sound? Shit. Did it just make a gulping sound for that E? Hold on, I need to play that back. Replay, go! 
Oh, totally. What do you think about that? It was totally legitimate. Is it hard the wallpaper in the storage room? Editing magic, you bitch. Yep. <laughs> in the music venue storage room, there should have been black wallpaper that's the same color as that scrap. There was also a tear along the edge of the wallpaper, wasn't there? Yeah. So, right. If you overlay the scrap that was caught on the lighting, the tear in the wallpaper. Yeah. If you overlay it just right. See, it fits perfectly. To it's look how perfectly it fits. It's perfect. Just, you could just, you know, line it up perfectly. So the scrap that was caught on the baton lighting was originally part of the wallpaper. And what's wrong with that? Does it have something to do with Hiyoko's body disappearing? I mean, probably. Oh, shit. That's oh, why he brought it up. <laughs> fuck. I, I already pieced this together. Oh, fuck. <laughs> Get it? I pieced it together? Because it's ripped. Fuck you. <laughs> I hope I hope to God what I just thought of isn't the case, but oh, what did you just think of? Uh, oh, we'll see if it's the case. A mere nobody like me isn't important enough to answer that. Yes, you are. But if you guys were exceptional enough to identify that scrap of paper, you can figure this out easily. Stuck to the battalion as part of the wallpaper I found in the storage room. It is connected to the sudden appearance of Hyoko's body. If I trace it back from there, the answer should become clear. Now we're gonna logic dive. Yeah, now we're logic diving. Okay, here we go. Logic diving. No, no, no. Good job, you hit the wall. Yep. And you're down to like half life. Oh god damn. Jesus Christ, these are very thin walls. You should you get there there you go, you did it. You eh. did it. Eh. Why'd you jump? Um here goes body uh, of It's fucking correct, isn't it? Oh uh, You're going renegade now. <laughs> oh no! That can't be it! What if it was hidden? Who hid it? Oh and my why? god, it's totally it. You just. <laughs> <laughs> Good job. God damn it, Hajima. God damn it, Hajima. You're on the edge. God damn it, Hideo Kojima. You. Whoa. Careful, you almost want the edge again. I Question know. two How did the killer hide her body? The wallpaper. Yoink. A curtain. A curtain. He's totally the right answer. <sighs> Hey, this is the answer too. It's great. I Wait. fell through the wall. I fell through the floor. How? Oh, there's a hole there. Yes. Yes, there is. Final question. Eh. Here we go. That's the checkpoint. Woo! It's this a me, very, Rainbow Road. This is a very thin logic dive. It's Rainbow Road dive. Rambo Road. Rambo Road. They formed a wall, and the Mexicans will have to pay for it. Don't make political jokes in your videos. Uh. God damn it! I was thinking like, oh, what if they fucking wrapped Hioko's body against the pillar? That was actually what fucking happened. Good job. <laughs> Shit. Who are you calling? Got it. Yoko's body was hidden before we found it. So they she died first or second? It is. At the same time? Uh well next time we'll continue this argument because fuck. <laughs> so who do you think did it? Uh I, I fucking I don't know yet, but we'll we'll figure it out next time. Uh, it'll come to mind soon as soon as I get more evidence. We'll see you guys next time! <laughs>